This is Gene Key, KTTD, Texas News. WFAA.com reports a Texas mother whose infant son vanished eight years ago will soon be reunited with him after authorities found the boy living with his former babysitter and her family in another part of the state. Miguel Morin disappeared in late 2004 when he was just eight months old. His mother said that the two may be reunited later this week. Authorities said she must first undergo a DNA test, even though they're sure of his identity. The former babysitter, 26-year-old Crystal Rochelle Tanner, was arrested Monday on a kidnapping charge. She was being held in a jail in San Augustine, a community about 140 miles northeast of Houston. The Texas Department of Family Protective Services said Thursday that Miguel, now eight years old, will remain at a foster home in the Houston area while investigators sort out his complicated case. The child apparently has never been in school. KHOU.com reports a small plane made an emergency landing near the San Jacinto Monument in southeast Harris County Thursday afternoon. Authorities said the plane, which was operated by Reynolds Aviation Pipeline Service, lost an engine around 11 a.m. The pilot observed that Vista Road, the road that leads to the third gate into the San Jacinto Battlegrounds, had fewer cars traveling down the road and little to no street signs. The pilot determined it was ideal for making an emergency landing. The pilot made a safe, controlled landing on the road, then maneuvered the plane onto the grass for safety. The battleground received an alert of a plane down, and the owners of the plane were contacted. A jeep was used to tow the 1,600-pound aircraft to a storage gate inside the battleground and will be transported by truck to its hangar today. KVUE.com reports investigators say a Central Texas special education teacher has been accused of having sex with a 13-year-old student and his 14-year-old friend. An affidavit Wednesday said 32-year-old Holly Lopez of Pflugerville faces charges of aggravated sexual assault and having an improper relationship with a student. Officers discovered Lopez exchanged nearly 850 texts with one of the students. Then, on February 11th, she allegedly went to a house with a box of condoms and had sex with the 13- and 14-year-old boys. A school directory lists Lopez as a special education teacher at Lexington Middle School in Lexington, about 50 miles east of Austin. She allegedly had been helping the younger boy with math. Lopez is now in jail on $100,000 bond. If you'd like the latest Dumas, Panhandle, and Texas news on your mobile device, you can follow KDDD News on YouTube. Simply search KDDD or Gene Key on Facebook or Twitter. This is Gene Key, SkyServe News.